Hey everybody, I wanted to uh, let you know that I just did that video. Um, I got a lot of comments about Chris's video uh, where Shelly had gotten a word and, and a picture and um, and yeah, I have seen it and I, and I want to tell you all that you should see it. Be, and I'll tell you what, th the reason why is because uh, Chris had a dream and then other people had a similar thing about something happening on August 5th. And um, it's something that could be very scary if you didn't think that God was going to rescue you from it. So I want you to remember too, the Ford escape, the Ford escape, God is coming. The rapture is an escape from evil. Um, so I want you to know, because, you know, he's not saying that's the day of the rapture as much as that will lead to it. So it will be bad enough that we will need an escape whether it's the nuclear war or something, I don't know. Uh, you know, God didn't show him exactly what it is. Um, I, you know, I have a couple ideas. Somebody mentioned something. It might, I don't know if it has to do with something that went on a few years ago um, that we don't want to see again. And uh, that was a nightmare on every level that would, and that would be a reason to escape. Um, but of course we're wait, we also know that, you know, he heard um, something about Israel too. So we, are, we know what's going on right now. We know it could happen any minute. Uh, I mean, we could literally see a nuclear exchange within days. It's possible. Um, the ingredients are on the table, um, and it will happen whether it happens tomorrow, the next day or not, it's going to happen soon. And, you know, most of you sense that you already know it. Um, you know, there've been so many ways that the Lord has shown different people what's about to happen. So, um... So I, I wanted to tell you that because if you know God said something ahead of time, then when you see what happens on the 5th, you'll remember, yeah, God warned me and he's the same God that's going to rescue me from it, whatever it is, okay? If the scary news comes and nothing happens right away, or, or what I mean is if, this, if the scary news comes and we're still here, uh, you got to, you got to know that God had already told you ahead of time so that you would believe that he's coming to get you. So there's no fear. The Bible says perfect love casts out fear because he who has fear has not been made perfect in love because fear has torment and God is not a God of torment or fear. He loves you dearly. Um, he's designed the whole thing from beginning to end. He's the alpha and the omega. He's coming to get us. That's why he's been telling us for years that he's coming because we need to hear it over and over and over. Until he comes, we need to hear it over and over and over again in case you haven't noticed. Faith comes by hearing and hearing by the word of God. The more you hear it, the more you believe it. And he, and he needs us to believe it, okay? Because the world is literally in extremely perilous times right now. So, uh, he's coming to get us and, you know, all the things in my last video are just more ways of him telling us not to worry that he's coming. Okay. So I need to stop this. Um, so I'll, I will leave a link to that video. Um, don't remember the name of it, but he just did it tonight on August 3rd. Okay, so, um, yeah, so, see you there.